This right here is the Smart Scene by Movo Photo. It's an all-in-one video kit for any smartphone and you can back it up on Kickstart right now. In this bag here, this is a video kit for people who take their phone seriously as videography or photography. Whether you're on Android or iPhone, it's gonna work with it. But first, let's go into his contents here. This is the fisheye lens, which gives you a huge wide angle. Obviously different caps for both sides, screws on. And then the left one here, this is the wide angle lens without the fisheye distortion. Let's take this out. This is my first time also playing with it and wow, this thing is actually pretty heavy duty. Like, you can see it kind of way down on my hand. This thing is made of metal and it has a soft rubbery grip on it. There's a mounting screw there and then we have a socket, a micro USB cable, smartphone microphone, 3.5 millimeters. Let's see, we have a lanyard, instruction manual. This is one whole piece and this makes the front. We have a microphone, check this microphone out. Pretty heavy duty. We got different decibel control on and off for the battery and it's a big microphone grill. We have a left and right stereo channel. The top is the headphone so we can monitor what we're listening to. And on the bottom, we have the line out. This white ring isn't just for looks, it's actually a light. Let's turn that on. And there's three modes. Definitely gets brighter for each. It also slides around to accommodate for the different size phones, obviously. The brand is on the front and on the side, this is where the tripod hookup is gonna be. And we also have a tightening. It does have a spring, so it springs down. And overall, this is made out of plastic, but it's very strong and thick plastic feeling here. I don't feel like if I would drop it, it would break into pieces. But another thing to mention is that the backing where the camera is gonna be for the phone is rubber. So obviously different phones are gonna have a different camera placement. So that's where we're gonna be able to adjust these. So at this point, I'm just gonna place it there. Okay, slide this over until I see it right about there. Okay, that's on there pretty tight. And here's where I'll tighten these. It's a little tight squeeze to get to. So here we go. Obviously this is portrait mode and we go landscape. I'm going to launch the camera and see if it obstructs anything and I don't see it having an issue. So I can still take pictures without any of these lenses. And now let's add the grip here. You could add your own if you have other ones. This just comes with it so it's very small to handle. So this is the way you're gonna hold it. All right, and if you want a lanyard, unscrew this back out, put this right in there. That way you don't drop it while you're using it. You got your hands here. If you do do crazy stuff. Now, depending if your phone has a headphone jack or not, if it didn't, you'll have a little dongle here to plug in through USB type C. So you plug it into your phone and it becomes a headphone jack. Those of you guys who have a headphone jack, don't worry about this. So that's where this will go to. The straight end goes into the phone and this will go into the unit. All right, let me take a picture. Take a picture right now. Now this is the fish eye lens, so I'm gonna put that in there and start screwing it. Now I'm gonna take a picture here and we're gonna see how wide angle that fish eye looks. Now check this out, this is the picture mode and let's go into the video and it punches in a lot more, but you can see here that I'm gonna press record and I'm recording and I'm gonna keep moving over and you will see the fish eye lens. It's pretty wide. How close can you get? Yep. As you can see, you can see both sides of the table. And I'm going to unscrew it here. Whoop. And now you see only literally just the strap. So that is a huge difference. And okay, now we're going to do just the wide angle without the fisheye distortion. Much smaller one here. Let me take a picture right now. All right. Now let's screw this on. Okay, let's take the picture and you will see that difference already. But let's place this right back to the spot. Take a picture once again, just so we can mark it. A picture right now, that's what it looks like. We'll compare those side by side so you can take regular pictures without any of these little lenses sitting there. And to recharge the light and the microphone, you wanna plug this right in there. So the last thing to test out is the microphone. Let's go check it out. Okay, I am talking behind the camera at this very moment. So this is what it sounds like from behind. I will put it in front of my face here in just a little bit. This is what it sounds like if I'm in front of it. I'm gonna tap on it. Okay, I am outside right now 
and I can hear a lot of noises. There's construction going on. There's birds chirping. There's me stepping down on leaves here. So I'm about, I can't even touch the camera if I reach for it. So that's like what, three feet or more. This is what it sounds like again from this. If you're gonna be recording a subject, it's gonna be a little bit closer than that. Up and close and personal. And again, I'm talking right into this microphone hole. So I'm gonna get right down below. And what does that sound like? And if I get right above it, what does that sound like? Now, if it's not loud enough, we can move over to the plus 10 decibel. And now you can hear the helicopter. I'm right next to this tree, and this is what it sounds like with that decibel increase. So if I get closer, I still can't touch the camera. This is about the area that I want it to be. That's what it sounds like. Let's turn that off. And now I'm going to go into the condenser. The condenser still the same recording and I'm all the way back to this little branch and you're gonna see that it does not sound as loud now let me get closer again uh, dimmer I can't touch it and you can see this is what it sounds like from this angle so if I'm behind the camera like this you're gonna be able to hear from this so there you guys have it. This right here is the Smart Scene. It's an all-in-one video kit for any smartphone and you can back it up on Kickstart right now. If you want one for yourself, you already know what to do, find it in the description down below and as always, I will see you guys next time. Later.